To teach your dog how to weave, you'll have to weave at home. The few minutes we have in class will not be enough to have your dog weave well. The quickest and easiest way to get started is with stick in the ground weave poles. I found electrical fence posts work well because they have a really long spike and they're pretty inexpensive too. You can find them on the internet or you can get six of them from me in class for $15. To get started, you'll need a string. Mark the string every 20 inches. That's a good length to use because it falls within a distance within the different organizations. This is going to give you your center line. You need to nail it down so it'll be taut. It's good to have a long string for enough for 12 poles because eventually you'll be working up to 12 poles. For the first channel, I'm going to use my wide open hand to give me the distance as a guide. I'm going to put the spike right here when my thumb is, thumb is extended. So using my hand as a guide, I'm going to put it against the center line and put the post in right there. When you put the post in, make sure you put the smooth side against your dog's coat. Initially, when we set it up, the channel, we're going to have it very wide. This is about 10 inches. We want to find out if the dog is sensitive about touching the poles as they go through. Before you get started with your dog, make sure you set it up correctly so the dog's left shoulder will be on this first pole. This is a good, inexpensive way to get started. But we need to move the equipment around constantly. In agility, the course changes at every competition. It's never the same. It's important to move your equipment around. This takes a little bit of time to set up, but you need to have different situations. You need to have your dog approaching it from different angles and at different parts of your yard when you're training at home. Once you become serious about agility, you may be willing to spend more than $15 to help train your dog to weave well.